Welcome back to TJ and B Traveling. Today we are exploring two of London's iconic spots, Chelsea and Battersea Power Station. We will explore Chelsea's stylish streets, old school buildings and delicious food. Then we will head over to Battersea Power Station which is now a cool spot for shopping, dining and entertainment. And we will see if this is actually worth the hype or not. Let's go! All right, so we're here at the Duke of York Square. This place is very picturesque. It is beautiful and it's a Saturday morning. They've got some sort of market going on. So B is going to explore, see if we can get some food. The market itself seems to be operating like what looks to be some sort of racetrack uh, going around this beautiful green here. There's people chilling on the green and then there's lots of stalls. So I'm definitely Sure, we're going to be able to get our hands and our mouths around something that sounded dodgy but you know what i mean let's check it out this market is pretty cute quite a lot of big enough to spot <laughs> yeah we haven't found that much rainforest creations this place looks so amazing first snack of the day put their instagram here because yeah. this food looks phenomenal mm, it's so good I'm so excited. Look at this food. Oh my god, I'm so excited. So much salad. Mm. It's so much good stuff. Yeah, yeah, this I looks delicious. Like you get a little bit of each of the salads, and it's just all so fresh. Mm hmm. Quinoa and mung bean hummus. This is the best salad I've had on this YouTube channel. One thing we've found walking around through Chelsea is the amount of cars that are flashy, pretty, Bougie. nice. <laughs> look, 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 look. Mercedes, Range Rovers. I'm personally loving this whole area. It's so fancy and pretty and nice. Everybody looks nice around here. <laughs> so much cool cars. I don't really like cars, but I'm, I'm really liking it. Impressed. Here. It's a different vibe, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, it's a different vibe. I just really like it. Very, very cool. Very impressed. It's definitely cool because it's like a cool contrast like a lot of the videos that we have on this channel are you know uh, the cheaper places and it shares many similar things that are just done differently which is like it's just interesting to see like what the more affluent area of London which is like one of the more affluent cities in the world is like it's just seeing it from like an outsider perspective. Pavilion Road definitely is one of the fancier parts of Pavilion. the fanciest area in London. Lots of beautiful cafes with lots of nice sandwiches, fancy coffees, just what all of the what, white people like. <laughs> it's very white here. It's very nice though. Yeah, this, this area is very cool. Again, we've lucked out a little bit with London here because it is such a beautiful day. Everything looks just so much better when it's in the sun, you know? So we've done a good job with that. Thank you, Mother Nature, sorted us out once again, but look. Very fancy. All right, now we're on Chelsea Bridge. Behind me is Pat Battersea Power Station that used to power all of London. And now, it's been turned into a shopping mall, apartment complex and all this, so we're going to go check that out. It's apparently one of the sights to see when you're in London, let alone this area, so we want to go check it out. Proper London, that's a good B-roll right there. Maybe even an A-roll. Let's go. Ahead. 
Mikey are looking at the sign to see if one says vegan. It's impressive as a power station, just as a building, considering how old it is and how huge it is. Like the history behind it, but then it's even cooler now than it's a apartment, shopping mall, everything. This is like a bar in the river. There's a place with the apartments to stay. Well, there's the mall to go and shop, which we'll go into later, but then there's all the food and cool stuff around here to hang around. It is not surprising that this has been a Malaysian investment, because if you think back to when we did our malls video in Malaysia, how similar it is, like that's what they look like, that's the sort of style that they've gone for. Here is a place that you can live, you can then go shopping, you can have everything that you need all within a short walking distance. Actually makes a lot more sense and brings it full circle for this being like the first series of videos that we've done since Kuala Lumpur that they've got a mall, mega mall and apartment place in London. Even cooler that it's an old power station which is, Jesus, it's impressive just to look at. And then behind me we've got even like a viewing, yeah, they've got a running track. Look at that, look. And it goes all the way around, I imagine. I saw they have even event for like race here. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is so cool. So you go all the way around. Yeah. Look. Oh, look, Padel. Oh, is that the event? No. <laughs> Actually, before we go in and check it out, we should mind how big it is. Just have a look. Like, go stand next to the wall so we can really gauge the size. This is so huge. It looks like a big park. It's crazy. This is proper luxury Malaysia style fancy mall with the with this Under Armour with the track inside that you can see. And the gym almost, yeah. Yeah, they have a gym here as well. They have a gym here, a Pilates center as well. They have so much in this place. It's crazy. B. This now has Kuala Lumpur vibes. Yeah, like very futuristic vibes, very cool. Yeah. <laughs> but this is really Kuala Lumpur vibes, like coming out of the mall into here. You know, imagine your house is just there and then you can come, I don't know. <laughs> what, buy right, anything that you want, yeah. Right, but yeah, and lots of food, restaurants. Everything. Some good food there. And then, very pretty apartment. So, this was a bit of our day and some insights. We think this place are definitely worth the visiting. We love and highly recommend them. And if you made it to the end, please hit the thumbs up, subscribe to our channel to see more videos like this, and leave a comment below. We love talking to you guys in the comments, and really does help a lot. Thank you guys for watching it, and we'll see you in the next one.